Before this video starts, I already got two videos in the works immediately that will be released later today, so please stay tuned. Also, this review will have spoilers in it, so if you haven't seen the movie, stop watching because there's some serious spoilers about to come up. I repeat, if you haven't seen the movie, stop watching because I'm about to tell you some serious spoilers. But if you've already seen the movie, enjoy the review. To finally say the Athena, to finally get the truth out of my chest and spoiler, yes. James Bond did die in that film. I mean, after all, it, it is like Craig's final film. I mean, that ending. <laughs> I didn't actually cry in the ending, but it was pretty sad. Like, I wasn't even crying, so you don't have to worry. That ending music, though, of James Bond being dead after being exploded with the missiles was very, very beautiful to listen to. I actually found a soundtrack of it on my YouTube, on YouTube, and that soundtrack of James Bond dying might be useful in a future 2022 film I'll be making where I will kill off my OC and then secretly bring him back in the post credit scene. Maybe that should be a future idea I should do eventually. But yeah, the film itself was pretty good. It was pretty good. The opening explained the story of this, I can't remember his name probably, but the guy with the white mask shot his shot the daughter's mom, saved the daughter from the ice, and then it picks up where James Bond and this girlfriend, I'm sorry I can't remember names, go to this, I don't know what place this is, but all right, forget the beginning let's just go straight for the presentation the the opening of the film was beautiful like i've keep in mind i have seen the original james bond's films like i'm still looking through them all in order like they're all not connected they're all like separated novels like yeah i did see the old school james bond's films i saw four of them i need to see the fifth one the one with sean conroy rest in peace but yeah, as for the film itself, it was pretty good. It did have a lot of cool action and all the other stuff. They finally kill off that one guy and somehow the villain almost looks like Dr. No. Like, if you haven't seen the original James Bond, he's the guy with the black gloves, white suit. If you have seen the very first James Bond, the guy almost looks like Dr. No. Just his face and his head. But yeah. It was pretty sad seeing James Bond die, and that music was very sad as well. I will give the film a seven or a seven point eight out of ten. So that is the spoiler review of No Time to Die. Now one more thing. I did hear a rumor or something about who's gonna play the next James Bond. And one of the cast one of them was the guy that played as Superman from the Man of Steel, while the others are Tom Hardy and Tom Holland? I mean, Tom Holland's a, st a good actor still. He is British, do not get me wrong, but he's still young. But don't worry. I know they'll find an actor like James Bond out there. And I know they will. My mom, when I was seeing it, my mom said maybe I should volunteer as James Bond. I mean, I do almost look exactly like him, even though I'm not calm like him. But I, I could be a good James Bond if I'm... A little bit older like I, I would probably do it when I'm 50 or something so yeah and rest assured I don't think and what I know is they won't make the next James Bond film go woke come on besides I know they won't do it anyway they're just gonna give the franchise a little break and then find a new actor to finally resume it and then boom I did read a news article something about after the credit scene there's no post credit scenes, but in the end, it will say something of James Bond will return. I read that in an article once, and it says it for all the James Bonds film. So I'm assuming it said it for this one. Yes, James Bond did die in that film, but he, the actor might be replaced by someone new. We don't even know who it is yet, but for sure, I just hope the next film isn't a woke film. So yeah. Other than that... Hope you guys like this video, subscribe for more, and I will see you guys in the next video, so peace out.